So that's again who you work with is really matter because one time I remember I was presenting the seller and I received the off one of the offers on, on his house and as we were reviewing the offers I'm going step by step on the contract and I'm going through the terms and I see the buyer agent is charging a lot of fees to the buyers with my understanding and my belief it shouldn't be there they're charging them some management fee, they're charging them their brokerage cut fee to the buyer, and they're charging them transaction coordinator fee, which is that's the most common, everybody charge it. I do not personally charge for it. And they have a risk fee, management fee, and they have their fees for the broker, I don't wanna mention the name, end up almost $4,000 additional cost to the buyer. When I presented the, those facts to my client, to my seller, he says, you know what, I don't feel good about this agent to the next offer. So again, it really matter who you work with. I'm not saying it's illegal, and I'm not saying it's probably unethical. As long as this agent disclosing to the buyer what they're charging them, probably that's fine. Uh, but what I've noticed, a lot of buyers, they don't ask. They just don't. So, and it goes just all together with the closing cost, and that agent probably could be making more money beside the commission, just charging those small extra fees. So who you work with is really, really matter.